And it's Priscilla Batzell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery in the backyard. And I have shovels full of colors left over and I seem to keep adding more colors to them. So I need to use them and I have an idea. A cool idea, I think. I have three. I think they're four by four inch. I think they are. Pretty sure. Two and two, yeah. Three four by four inch Arteza canvases from when Arteza sent me some supplies. And I'm going to use... You know what? First, I'm going to spread some paint, very thin layer of paint, all over my three little canvases with my OXO omelet turning spatula, just because I want a layer. And I'm going to put my glasses on too so I can really see what I'm doing. And then I'll worry about what's in between after, because I think there's going to be so much paint from the shovel that it will be available to run down the edges and cover the edges. We'll see what happens. This is the first time I've ever tried this. Um, I've done triptychs, but not with fluid acrylics before. Those two painting, those two canvases are not the same height. And I'm going to have to be careful because they are sticking together now. I want to put that one in the middle. <laughs> Go figure. Whatever. It doesn't look like there's nearly as much paint on the center panel until now. Well, whatever there is there is what there is. That spatula is going in the bucket. And I want a little bit more gold, which I've mixed with mica powder, which is on my Amazon link along with the book because I can. And I'm going to throw a little bit of that in there at that end. And a little bit of that in there at that end put the cover back on so I don't spill it. I'm going to let that... Boy, oh boy, I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I want that gold to be integrated a little bit more, so I'm going to stick my skewer in there. I can't tip these. I can use this, the paint I've got leaking out of my shovel. I'm going to pull them apart. And I think I'm right about those little... I'm going to pull them apart and push them together again. I've got more paint in my shovel. And I'm going to use one of my Princeton Art Tool Catalyst spatulas. Because that's some nice blue paint. And other colors. Maybe a few dots. <laughs> As an afterthought, I have some really nice colors over on one edge. Actually, I have nice colors on both edges. I'm going to scavenge those right there. All right, so in theory, it should work like everything else. Yep, it does. Got some great little cells going. It'll take long. The paint in my shovel will touch up any edges that I didn't get with the uh, paint leaking down out, leaching down over. And I'm just going to let those be what they are. And if I don't tip them too much, because I have GAC whoops, because I have GAC 800 in them, they should be fine. I'm going to move that away. And I think they stand alone. The one in the middle does not have good coverage on its edges, but I'm willing to take a chance and risk using my finger. Let's check out this other one. That looks pretty good. And this looks pretty good. So I'm pretty good to go. Um, <laughs> I want to put them back together, but I don't want to make a, a bigger mess of the undersides of them. I'm going to have to put some white paint on the edges tomorrow, or later today, whenever. I'd like to put them back together for you guys, see what you can see. 
And that was easy peasy. I am Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expression Start Studio Gallery in the backyard. I have an Amazon link and if you shop on it, it helps me out. I have cool stuff there. Princeton Art Tool Catalyst Spatulas, voila. And shovels and uh, my book, because I can. Let's zoom right in as best we can. So that was that was neat. Four by four inch canvases, who knew? Um, I love them, they're cool. So it's really nice that you guys contribute to keep my studio going and when you do, you'll be entered in a contest to, uh, if I draw your name, to choose one of three paintings. I have over 400 videos. I have, uh, so there's more, if you like what you see. Um, <laughs> brain cramp. Give me a thumbs up if you wouldn't mind. I would like that very, very much and I appreciate it very, very much. It uh, helps my standing on YouTube. I have links to Pinterest and Instagram at the bottom of the description under Show More under the video, along with volumes one and two and maybe three of Facebook albums of wet and dry artworks from YouTube. And uh, I do sell my artwork, so if you have any interest in buying some, please let me know through an email and uh, we'll talk about it and uh, figure what out, whatever out. If you live in the Spring Hill area, I give classes, uh, private classes, one-on-one, -on -one, and uh, we always have a ball. So that would be nice to see you here. And uh, I'll see you guys, the rest of you guys, in the next video. Thanks for all the comments. I love you guys. Bye for now. Priscilla out.